What's going on folks? I'm about to show you how you would take out your blower motor inside of multiple different types of vehicles. This happens to be a Dodge um, Durango, but it's the same on Chevys, on Fords, on multiple different types of vehicles. If you look underneath your dashboard, pretty much on your passenger side compartment, right up underneath here, what you'll normally see is what I have my hand on right here. This is actually your blower motor right here that makes your AC blow, that makes your heat blow, you know, when you put it on hard or soft or something like that. And normally, all it is is a couple of screws that's up underneath here holding it up. I've already taken the screws out of it, so you'll see it drop down. See how it's dropped down like that? This actually right here is your blower. Yeah, once you take out those screws, as you can see, see as you can see this comes out and the opening that it was in if you can see basically is right there that open hole is actually where it goes at and this right here is your power connection that you want to unplug from off of your actual blower itself which came from right here this is where it plugs into your blower where that um, power core right there plugs into is right here so once you basically unplug it, you'll be able to remove your whole blower motor. And I'm also got a video showing you how you would test this motor to make sure it's good or if it's your actual control panel that's causing the problem of it not working. All you'll have normally is about three screws, sometimes four, that look about like this that's actually holding this up. And if you can see on this one, it was one here, one here, and one there. Once you remove those three screws, this whole blower motor will come down. You want to unplug your electrical harness just by squeezing it and pulling it out. Some of them may actually have like a little security tab on it, this little orange thing. All you got to do with that is kind of pull it over, like push it over, then squeeze and unplug it and you'll be good. All right, folks, once again, this is how you would change out a blower motor on multiple different models and brands of vehicles from Fords to Chevys to GMs to just, just about all vehicles. Your blower motor is in the same location, which is right up underneath your passenger side dashboard. All right, please check out our other videos and please subscribe. Thanks.